Good morning, Vivek. Hope you're having a great day. Here's your daily news briefing. Let's dive right in. First up, a story that's been making waves in the AI community. Elon Musk, the CEO of Tesla and SpaceX, had some ambitious plans for OpenAI between 2015 and 2018. Musk explored merging OpenAI with Tesla, or even taking full control of the AI research company. He proposed majority equity, control over OpenAI's board, and taking on the CEO position. However, OpenAI felt this could conflict with their mission, leading to Musk's departure and his hint at creating a competitor focused on AI safety. Despite Musk's suggestion of a merger in 2018 as a funding path for Tesla, OpenAI has remained steadfastly independent. Moving over to India, the country is signaling a strong commitment to artificial intelligence. The Indian government has approved an investment of $1.2 billion in AI over the next five years. This move is set to fuel research and development efforts, aiming to bolster domestic AI innovation. Additionally, a groundbreaking step in education has been taken with IRIS, the nation's first AI-powered humanoid robot teacher, making its debut. Developed by Maker Labs, IRIS showcases complex capabilities including object manipulation, and the ability to engage students in interactive learning sessions. In the realm of AI startups, Inflection AI is stirring the pot with its new model, Inflection 2.5. The company is positioning it as a competitor to GPT-4, boasting significant reductions in training costs. Their free chatbot, Pi, has quickly amassed a user base of 6 million, highlighting the model's popularity and potential. Speaking of innovation, Hugging Face, known for its machine learning tools and as a chat GPT competitor, is stepping into the world of robotics. They've launched a new open source project, led by former Tesla AI scientist Remy Kadeen. This project aims to integrate AI technologies into low-cost robots, focusing on deep learning and embodied AI, pushing the boundaries of robotics and AI collaboration. Over at OpenNI, there's been a significant board expansion, welcoming back CEO Sam Altman along with three new members. This move addresses previous criticisms regarding the board's composition and aims to incorporate diverse perspectives in AI development. Shifting gears to the business segment, Victoria's Secret is facing a tough time with sales forecasts for 2024 significantly below expectations. This marks a third consecutive year of decline reflecting changing consumer preferences and the challenges of adapting in a rapidly evolving market. On a brighter note, the Indian rupee 